I believe that quality and precision and function creates a high perceived value and fulfills the promise of design. I'm Carl Gustav Magnuson. I'm an industrial designer and inventor. Since the age of 12, I've been enamored and obsessed with automobile design, and therefore it permeates everything else that I do, uh, such as architecture and industrial design of furniture. Everything that I do has a certain mechanical logic to it and follows my definition of design, which is function with cultural content. It's not enough that it works very, very well. It also needs to embody uh, certain cultural aspects. When I designed this lamp, I incorporated some of the vocabulary in the electric racing car into the slots here uh, that show when the light is on. And in those subtle ways, we're able to translate what's going on here into what's going on here. It also becomes part of the signature of the designer. We want to have a product that is maximizing the engineering capabilities as simple as possible, as strong as possible, best uh, strength to weight ratio and blends itself equally to an automobile as it does to a piece of office furniture. I think that it's always been important for designers to be multifaceted, accumulating experiences and knowledge from various places to the point uh, that you can solve the problem in a very holistic manner. My greatest inspiration is trying to solve problems that come simply through uh, observing uh, opportunities where design could solve a problem that's very important. And one of the examples is the ambulance, which I've now designed, um, which is only 42 inches wide. I noticed the obvious. Motorcycles and bicycles seem to get through traffic much faster than the automobiles and certainly faster than ambulances. Therefore, make the ambulance very narrow, you're going to be able to get through at a much higher speed and save lives by bringing the patient to the hospital in time to help. Design matters because it assimilates all the various aspects of function and cultural content. It also sets us in a period of time. It identifies us in history.